Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to make your own lip gloss. So let's just get started. First you're going to be needing a container, a paint container or an old eyeshadow. But yeah, you're going to be needing that. Some clear lip gloss. This I prefer, that's the best Burt's Beeswax lip balm because it has um, beeswax in it. Beeswax is super hydrating. And of course you're going to be needing some um, eyeshadow or old lipsticks to make the color. And you're also going to be needing some rubbing alcohol I have in here and some Q-tips or cotton swab. I mean, or cotton ball. So first with your eyeshadow thing palette, you're just going to grab a Q-tip, dip it in your alcohol, just sanitize it really well. And I'll be right back after I'm done sanitizing. Yeah, okay, guys, and you're also going to be needing, like, a garbage can to throw your cut swabs away. <laughs> guys, sorry again, but you're going to be needing some tissues or toilet paper for this, too. Got tissue. No, sorry. Okay, so, guys, I finished sanitizing with my Q-tip. But now, as you can see, like, the mirror is dirty and there's some, like, on the sides. And you're just going to want to grab your thing, wrap it up into, like, a, like, thing. Dip it in there a little bit. Wring it out, of course. And then just wipe it down, wipe the mirror down. The whole thing down, so it is nice and clean. Cause you do not want to have a shadow on your lip. Well, well, since like you don't, you just don't want it to change colors and stuff. Sanitize it really good. And guys, I didn't even know that I had al rubbing, rubbing alcohol in my um thing. So yeah. Get the inside really, really good until it's like spotless. And guys, after I'll just wipe off the outside of it so it's clean. Okay, and then you're just gonna wanna grab these. Just it's like go like this, so then it's like all sort of off. Yeah. Okay, guys. So now, now you're done. Now that you have this, you're just gonna wanna go to your sink. Grab some of your cotton swabs and wipe it down, so I'll be right back. Okay, i done that. Now it is spotless. Mine has a mirror right here. So now, now let's just get started. Okay, so now first you're just going to want to grab your Burt's beeswax. Sorry, guys, I have a runny nose. I'm sick. And, um, just want to... Okay, guys, this is why you need some... Like a lot of Q-tips by you. I'm gonna use your like no, you're gonna use your Q-tip and try to wipe. We'll grab some off like that. Just put it into your container. Well, well, actually, now you're just gonna grab it off your Q-tip, throw your Q-tip away, and then you're just gonna wanna that in your first container. That's why I need to pause it. Well, okay, so guys, you should have this in there, right over here. And now you're just going to grab your Q-tip and just, like, push it. Well, no, guys, use your finger and push it down into there. Oh, guys, I forgot to tell you, you're also going to be needing some toothpicks. I'm like forgetting everything. And then now you're just gonna grab one of your toothpicks and just like mix your bird's beeswax around a little bit. And now, after that, you're just gonna wanna add just a little bit of your clear lip gloss. Just a teeny bit, like two, two or one, one or two drops. Is it? But it has to be really small. Now once you have that, you're just going to want to grab your toothpick, 
just mix that up until your bird's beeswax is sort of like mixed in with your lip gloss. So you want to see that there's that there's like like no chunks in it. So, yeah. So guys, technically that is your like base, and then you technically just add whatever color. Except I don't, I don't have that. No, I just shut it. It wasn't even done. So since I barely have none in here, I'm gonna add a little bit more of each of them. But first, I'm gonna blow my nose. Ah. Okay, just wait. Now, I'm just gonna grab some of this. Put it in here. Ah, I do like that down, and then just a little bit like this stuff. Oh my God, it's sticking to my toothpick. I'm just gonna mix up. This is the baby pop, and I got it for 50 cents. Really good deal. You guys, I finished now. I have a lot more in it. Right in there. Now you're just gonna want to add a color of your choice. First, I'm gonna use the blush. You just wanna grab your toothpick and just start scraping some into there. A little bit at a time. I just added like the smallest amount in the world and look how much the how dark that is. It's like told dark. Yeah, I'll be right back because I want it really dark. Okay guys, I have finished. Now since the edges is are dirty, I'm just gonna grab one of my q tips and wipe around it. And guys, please don't take this the wrong way. I am not copying Karina Garcia's. Because I, I actually downloaded this video way before her, except somehow we got deleted. Except I don't know why. But yeah. So she must have watched my video. And guys, please go watch her video and tell her that I sent you guys to watch her video. So yeah, that's really how you make your own lip gloss. Now for mine, I just want to add a little bit more of my lip gloss. Oh my gosh, guys, it's been eight minutes already. But guys, technically the lip gloss is like the base of it, plus the bird to be So I'm just going to mix that up. guys finished okay so i hope you guys like this video please give it a th big thumbs up like comment subscribe subscribe